All right. So what are we supposed to do? Let's determine the T value in each of the cases. Let's click the icon icon to view the table of areas. We're not going to use that because we're using the calculator to, to solve this problem. It's saying find the T value such that the area in the right tail is 0 0.1 with 8 degrees of freedom. All right. So let me draw a picture of a normal distribution, or in this case, a T distribution. We have the area in the right tail. Okay, so we can give ourselves a little tail on the right. That area is 0 0.1. All right, and we're looking for T alpha over 2. Whenever we're trying to find like a T score or a Z score, that's the case when you use inverse T. And we're going to put in 0 0.9 actually, and then the degrees of freedom, which are 8, which are given. And the 0 0.9, that's going to be the area to the left all right so this function takes the area to the left then the degrees of freedom and it gives you sort of a z-score in this case a t-score so if we look at that we have inverse t 0.9 comma 8 so it's 1.397 so 1.397 we were supposed to round to three decimals so that would be the answer and that's it